Hello, thank you for your interest in Wayne Combustion's MSR oil burner. Today we'll review a number of adjustments that can be made to the burner. Please note that these adjustments should only be made by a trained technician. Oil gun assembly removal. Tools required. 1 quarter inch nut driver. 5 16th inch nut driver. 7 16th inch wrench and a 9 16th inch wrench. Mark the current position of the oil gun assembly on the side of the burner housing. There is a scale die cast into the side of the burner housing above the slot cover plate. The oil gun assembly slot cover plate itself has a positioning groove stamped into it along the upper edge. Mark the position of the mark in relation to the scale with a sharp point permanent marker. This mark will make positioning the reinstalled gun assembly much easier should the slot cover plate screw need to be loosened again during oil gun assembly removal. Loosen the brass oil line assembly nut at the connection with the brass fitting on the solenoid oil valve. Loosen and disconnect the brass nut of the copper oil line assembly from the oil gun assembly fitting and rotate the oil line assembly out of the way. Open the burner top cover plate by removing two screws located near the front edge of the cover using the quarter inch nut driver. Loosen the burner top cover plate screw on the fuel pump side of the burner with the 5 16th inch nut driver. Open the burner top cover plate by swinging it up and back, resting it on the burner nameplate surface of the unit. With the 9 16th inch wrench, Loosen and remove the oil gun assembly lock nut. Remove the oil gun assembly by pushing the oil gun assembly oil pipe fitting into the housing through the housing slot cover plate. At times, loosening the housing slot cover plate will ease getting the oil gun assembly out of the housing. To do this, loosen the screw holding the slot cover plate to the housing with a 5 16th inch nut driver. Tip, before loosening the screw, make certain the position of the oil gun assembly was marked as described above. It will now be possible to remove the oil gun assembly from the burner housing. Rotate the oil gun assembly clockwise so the gun assembly oil pipe fitting connector is approximately at the 10 o'clock position. Pull the oil gun assembly toward the back of the burner lifting the oil gun assembly oil pipe fitting end slightly to clear the burner's interior partition plate. The oil gun assembly is now out, ready to service. The nozzle and electrode assemblies may now be replaced. 